In today's video, I'm going to show you exactly how to import a new tile set into RPG Maker. Firstly, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to quickly paint this map, go over to the B tile, and I'll add a couple of things. Maybe this lamp here. Maybe a little this tent over here. I'm going to go over into the resource manager. Then I'm going to scroll down to tile sets, and I'm going to hit import. Scroll to the file that you want to import. In this case, it's going to be outside B for me, as well as outside A2. After we hit import, I'm just going to hit close. And as you can see, a whole bunch of stuff's changed. That's because if we scroll up, the B tile now has different items on it, as well as the A tile has a different set of auto tiles. Now, the way I got those files is I went into a standard game file. I opened up images tile sets and I copied all of these images and I moved them to a different file. Then what I did once I had these in a different file is I open it up in Photoshop and I just draw over the top of all of the different things here. So if we were to make a brand new tile, I'm just going to make a box. Now that I've made this box, I'm just going to save this file and now if I go back over to my resource manager down to tile sets and I import that same image again which was outside B you can now see this little box has appeared up in the corner so let's just make a little path running through the center and now I can place the box Another thing you can do is smash the like button because that is a quick and easy way to show you how to import new tile sets into RPG Maker. I will be making videos in the future where I go over how to actually make different tile sets and do some pixel art, but that's not for today. But if you are looking for more content like that, and if you love RPG Maker tips, tricks, tutorials, and just general discussion about RPG Maker, then scroll down and hit subscribe and the bell icon so you get notified whenever I upload a new video.